What's up, guys? Welcome back to Taste Cup of Joe. It's Woo! been a minute. I know it's been a great. So we are going to do Kit Kat tastings. As you guys can see, we have a bunch of Kit Kats that we actually got from our trip in Japan, and you will see some open like this. But I promise you, I promise you, we did not try any. I gave some to my friend because yeah. I put a, put together a little like a gift bag, um, gift bags for them with things from Japan. So everybody, I want everybody to have some. If you have not subscribed to our channel, please make sure you subscribe to our channel. Give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below on what you think. I cannot wait to try these flavors. Um, I heard about, even prior, about the Kit Kats being different flavors in Japan, mm -hmm. but I didn't know that it was like this. I don't know what I thought, honestly. I don't even know if I had much of a thought, but... <laughs> <laughs> what? I wasn't thinking they were going to be to this extent. Like, this is like a matcha flavor. See, some, some of them don't have it in English, which is obviously fine, but I just, I had to Google some of these. So I'm going to Google them again, actually, because I might, I, forgot, I need to give you the accurate I thought this was pizza, it's cheesecake. Don't yeah. it look like a pizza? <laughs> that would have been fire. But yeah. this says cheesecake flavor. Like some of them say that, some of them don't. So this that's just what's going on here. Well, we'll just show you as we, want, we go. Are we each trying the same ones or are we? Yeah, just... we should try the same one at the same time. That's okay. the thing. All right, all right, but all right. do you want to go like. I'm kind of scared. I'm petrified. You don't have to get I don't even like cheesecake as weird as that is. But Me either. I like, love Kit Kat. Kat. I love Kit Kat so much. Where you think this it's going to ruin it for you? This is kind of scary. But you want to start with what you think is going to be least bomb to most bomb? Like, how do you want to do this? All right, so I think the least bomb will either be between peach yeah. and this one, whatever it's called. I think it's oh. going to be. That's dark matcha. I feel like that's going to have a, a good vibe to it. But. For me, I think it's gonna be peach because I just personally am not a big peach person anyway. Let's uh, try peach. Cheesecake is probably gonna be the nastiest. You think you wanna try a cheesecake? Yeah, that's good. Okay, so we are trying the cheesecake flavor of the Kit Kat. Ah! Are we each eating a whole thing or just breaking it off? Breaking off a piece of that Kit Kat. Oh, yeah, we'll just Kit put it in half. Right. You gotta really sink in the flavor. That kinda smells good though. It does smell good. It doesn't smell bad at all. Alright, ready? One, One two, two, three. three. <laughs> Dummy. It's not like it's a big deal. Oh my gosh, that is good. <laughs> that is good. That tastes like chocolate. It tastes like white chocolate. Yeah. Right. Yeah. What the heck? Wait, that that's wow. What the heck? No, that's good. That's a white. That tastes like white chocolate Hershey's. I feel like I I can taste like the aftertaste having a little bit of like a a, a tag a twang a, a twang little, of like cheese yeah like cheesecake I should say yeah I know what you're talking about you know but it but I, I, guess, I could I could taste the twang you can taste it the what twang. are we rating this out of 10 let's rate him nah that's a 10 that's a 10 I ain't gonna lie that's a I 10 I think I'm gonna give it a I think I'm gonna give it a 9.5 just cause that twang but it's bomb it's a 10 out of 10 because I was expecting it to be a 1 and it actually ended up being like bomb, bomb. we going for peach we going for peach let's go for peach you know, come to like now that I tasted that, I think they're all gonna be good. I, it's not gonna. You I know, don't you know. know those those, uh, those jelly beans that had like different nasty flavors. Oh, like the poop flavors. Aww. Yeah. And they made it so cute. It's looking like the Valentine's Day edition, even though it's probably how it always looks. It has and a little heart and stuff. So it's cute. How's it smell? Like peach. This does kind of smell fruity. This smells fruit. T A F. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, ready? I'm <laughs> ready. One, two. I'm not crazy over it. I'm gonna finish it, but it tastes soapy. Oh my god, that's the perfect def description of that. Right? Do you guys ever taste this soap? It could be kind of sweet and. Oh, that that's, tastes soapy. That's soap. Oh, that tastes like soap. Oh like my soap. god, yeah. You know, sometimes you could taste things by smelling it too. Yeah, it that's, tastes how it smells. I can yeah, see yeah. Saying. That was a one. I'm not gonna say a one. I'm gonna say that's a, a one. I'm gonna say a three. Because I think it's flavorful, it's like way more flavorful and it's good for the people who like peach most likely, but it does have like a really soapy taste to it. It wasn't the nastiest flavor, but it felt like whatever they used to make it was like super artificial or maybe too real. I don't know. I think, I, I think that maybe um, it's too real. there's some like sweetness that doesn't blend well with chocolate. Yeah. And this is yeah. one of them, yeah. The next one that I'm scared of is graham crackers. Like... It's like graham cracker chocolate or like what like 
you know? Like, Maybe, I think, you know what I think the, it is? Is the outer level graham cracker or just the inside? I think the inside of it. You know, like the wafer? Yeah. I think it might like be graham, graham cracker. cracker. That's interesting. You want to try it? That sounds like kind of good, though. It does, but we can still try it. It's like chocolate graham cracker, like almost like a s'more. Is that graham cracker with Yeah, chocolate? but I wonder if the outer layer tastes like chocolate or if it tastes like graham cracker. Okay, smells like nothing. Yeah, I don't smell anything. Yeah, it's not like... Okay. Sorry, babe. Sorry. All right, ready? Almost. That's good. But I can't quite get the flavor. I might need another one. Oh my god. That was good. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, that was actually pretty good. It's um It has a crackery flavor, but the outer layer doesn't taste like chocolate, but it doesn't taste like cracker. I think it does. You ever had like chocolate with salty stuff? It kind of blends really well. I'm not like a sweet and salty person. It's not that salty, but I think that saltiness takes away from the chocolate flavor, but it's a good blend. Hmm. See, if I had tried this with a blindfold on, I would never have guessed it was graham cracker, though. I can see that. You know, cookies they give you on the plane? Biscoffs. Yeah. Yes. It tastes like that. I could see that. With a little bit of chocolate. So you want to try this next, I'm assuming, right? Dark matcha? Yeah. Also, I was excited when I found this one. I found this one. I was, guys, I was scavenging through. So they had, like, um... She spent $100 on Kit Kat. No, I didn't. Um... They had like levels of all the Kit Kats. I got every flavor that they had, by the way, in the store that we were in. So this was actually hidden up beneath a bunch of strawberry. And I like saw, I was like, oh my gosh, another flavor. Cause I was like, there gotta be more flavors than this. But anyways. Oh my gosh. What is matcha? I don't know. I don't it's know like a, I know it's like a tea, like it's almost like a green tea vibe. Ew. Ew. <laughs> Give me a break. Give me a break. You're always trying to steal my shine. I don't know. Never. Like, I love how you just touch all my pieces. Like, stop doing that. You know what? When you put your nose right up to it, it does have smell like matcha. I'm ready for it. Okay. You ready? Ah, this tastes like matcha. This tastes like straight up matcha. Like matcha powder is what it tastes like. This one, I'll give it a, like, six. I'm going to give this one... A four. I'm not crazy over it. It's that after flavor, yo. That, yeah, it hits you crazy. Yeah, so I, it I, hits you that, right crazy. Now that it's sitting with me, I'll give it a five. Oh, no. I give what? it a three. <laughs> <laughs> it gets like a powdery, like a yeah, weird Yeah, it's almost like a, I'm thirsty now. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, you've been thirsty. What's up? So the next flavor we are going to be trying is chocolate orange, which honestly does not sound bad. It's probably really good. Have I ever had some chocolate and orange? I'm trying to think. Chocolate covered orange. What? That's a thing? No, I don't know. Orange is such a distinct flavor, like chocolate and orange, I don't think it's ever gonna go to right together. So this is actually the first one that we've seen that is covered in like the actual chocolate. Oh, it smells citrusy. It smells like an orange, but it's actually chocolate on it. Oh. That's interesting. It's like, off on gray at the same time. <laughs> I don't know what I'm I just, it's like nasty, but not nasty. Yeah. Oh, that was nasty, though. What's not nasty about it is the chocolate. The oranges was nasty about it. It's the combination that's nasty. Like, you can taste the chocolate and the orange, and it's almost like they're two completely different flavors that don't blend that, well. That you taste at once. Yeah, yeah. you're tasting both of them, and, it, and they're, they're both, both good. strong. Yeah. They're good separately, but not together. Exactly. Yeah. Like, I love chocolate Like, if it was an orange, orange Kit Kat, that might have been okay. What the hell are you talking about? Like, a straight-up orange Kit Kat flavor. That is straight-up orange. No, this is chocolate orange, obviously. Huh? Huh? So that, they're all chocolate, baby. They're just different color chocolate. They're not all chocolate. This has, like, this is actually called chocolate orange. This isn't called freaking chocolate strawberry. Cho it's Show me the flavor. Proof. So, what do you want to try next? Strawberry or the... This one's going to be the best chocolate. one. I've had this years ago. I've never had it, so I've had the what do you want to try? Let's do strawberry one. Okay. So we're going to do the strawberry one. I have a very water? cute one. All right. Now this smells like straight up strawberry. Like strawberries and cream. So is it berries and cream. Berries and cream. Take your half. Babe. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to like this one. Straight up strawberry. 
Smells like strawberries and milk. That's good. It's a little too strong for me though. Oh. This is definitely worse than the peach. No, it's not. You're out your mind. Stop. Stop. The drama is for real. It like tingles my tongue. It just tastes like, almost like the filling of a Pop-Tart. Mixed without the, the Pop-Tart. You know I what I'm saying? I never had a strawberry Pop-Tart. What? I know what you mean by the peach thing. Like it has that element of like, that sweetness. That sweetness. Yeah. But the peach was way nastier. It's because you're more familiar with the strawberry flavor. Maybe, but the strawberry tasted like strawberries and cream. I feel like strawberry makes more sense of a flavor, where peach is like, mm. So I rate that one like a 6 out of 10. We're tough critics. What, what, did, we, what did we rate? We're just picking, so don't even trust tough. us. I gave a 10 and a 9. Now we have this. Oh, oh. And strawberry, hold on. Strawberry, I'll give it a 6. All right, so this is like considered, I guess, white. They call it white, so it's like white chocolate. Kit Kat, which we say the best for last. Strawberry is like a Imagine six and a half. Imagine it's nasty. Seven. Strawberry is like six and a half, seven. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go ahead. Thanks so much for telling me. Again. It looks like cookies and cream. I think it might be. Sorry, I didn't let you unpack any of them. Cookies, cookies and cream. Or like a chocolate wafer here. Ten out of ten. That's a hit. You know what? It's because we're so familiar with chocolate. We're expecting all these to taste like a real Kit Kat when in reality that's not the point of them. Mm. But that's really good. That's a cookies and cream Hershey's right there. I feel like it's a little less than that of a cookies and cream, but it is a white chocolate. I feel like I really tasted white chocolate rather than cookies and cream. Really? Yeah. I taste the cookie and the cream. It's not cookies and cream though, so I don't know what you're tasting. But you just said that it was cookies and cream. No, I didn't. What did you just I said you say? it looks like a cookies and cream. And then what did you say after that? That it tastes like white chocolate. This was a ten out of ten. I'm sad that we don't have more. I looked up the Kit Kat flavors after and I saw, you know, obviously they're not gonna all be in every in one store, but there's a plethora. Alright, so if you guys go to Japan, make sure you get some flavors. And you know what? Get some other flavors, because there's a lot. Get some lemon. Hit the, your, your, Hit your, your Don local, Quixote. Yes. They have them. Um, also, there's a lot of like little souvenir shops, I think, that have them here and there. We didn't really see many while we were there, but I saw them at Don Quixote. So this was all they had, and I got every single flavor. I hope you enjoyed watching us try these Kit Kat flavors because it's actually quite interesting. Mm -hmm. Something different for you folks. All right, well, see you soon, guys. Peace. Bye-bye.